This is Insider Medicine in 60 from Arizona. Deep brain stimulation, a type of brain pacemaker used to stop unwanted body movements in some with Parkinson's disease, may have unwanted side effects. Those who underwent deep brain stimulation showed poor impulse control when compared to those on regular medications. From New York, medicines used to treat blood pressure may one day be used to prevent the development of Alzheimer's. Researchers examining the effect of 55 antihypertensive medicines on tissue cultures of mice were able to identify seven that significantly affected the production of beta amyloid. In addition, the drug Diavan lessened cognitive deterioration. From Boston, add psoriasis to the growing list of conditions linked to smoking. Data from the Nurses Health Study 2, an ongoing study of over 100,000 nurses, estimates that smokers are 78 percent more likely to develop the condition. The good news is that those who did not smoke for over 20 years had a similar risk to those who never smoked. And finally from Los Angeles, lay patient navigators or LPNs, a group of volunteers that can act as a guide for patients through a medical maze, can help patients receive better care. Research on nearly 500 low-income women show that using LPNs help patients overcome significant medical barriers and resulted in more patients agreeing to participate in clinical trials. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.